Andy and the Pharaoh's Cat by Carolyn Watson Dubish. For my daughter, Naomi, my most excellent studio assistant and an avid cat admirer, September 2020. I stayed late after school one day. I was playing the pharaoh in the second grade play. As I practiced my lines, I spied a striped cat. He looked at me strangely from where I sat. I took off my necklace and enticed him to play. Then he snatched it up and ran away. The pyramid set was dark, but not so dark he could not hide. The cat was nearly in my grasp when he bolted out onto a path. As I stepped out, the sun was bright, and the striped cat was nowhere in sight. I followed the path all the way down to what seemed to be an Egyptian town. The marketplace was crowded. There was so much to see. For Egyptians, this was the place to be. I wandered down the bustling street. When suddenly, the cat was at my feet. I lunged for the cat, but he slipped away. He'd bolted through an ornate doorway. Down a great hall, I followed that cat. And into the throne room, where the pharaoh sat. Why do you dress like the pharaoh, young man? Oh, my sire, I'm your biggest fan. From the corner of my eye, I saw the cat slip through the door. Respectfully, I bowed and followed him once more. The cat dropped the necklace and jumped up on a stool. I looked around, and I was back at school. I stepped out on stage for my final bow. But the pharaoh's cat had the last meow. Thank you for reading with us. This book was read by Storytime. If you'd like to share more stories with us, please subscribe to our channel below.